Good evening, ladies and gents, my name is Hilzo and welcome to Discuss Things. I know that I haven't been posting almost any videos in 2018 and in 2017, however, I had some issues, you know about them if you have watched some of my videos, but it doesn't matter because I have a new video for you and this one is a doozy. Now, this video is a question more so because i have been confused as to what exactly happens with certain things on the internet after a certain periods of time as well as certain trends that usually have a time span a lifespan that has to go away at a certain point and that doesn't happen anymore i think because we have not one but two things that should be dead and they're not i'm of course talking about Tide Pods and Ugandan Knuckles. Those two things, you see them? Yes. Those two things are what I would consider <laughs> that hasn't gone away at all. And I don't understand why. Usually a meme goes on for a few weeks, maybe a month or two or three. And then it dies out and just merges with the others. Same is with a challenge like the condom challenge, like the ice bucket challenge, even though that was, was a little bit longer because it has a purpose. But now it seems that these things are becoming even more lengthy and refuse to die. And especially the Tide Pod challenge. It still goes on, it's still in the news. What the hell? First of all, let's talk about the Tide Pod challenge. You eat detergent pods. You eat something that's made out of chemicals. It's used to wash clothes from very, very sturdy stains. And you put it in your mouth and you eat it as a challenge. Don't get me wrong. I know that this topic has been discussed a lot already. Every major YouTuber, every news channel, there are articles about it. However, I must ask, because it seems to me that there is something wrong in the upbringing of certain children who use that, who do that, who do these challenges. How the fuck are you so stupid? How do you get to walk around the streets, the blocks, to even interact with other human beings while you're so stupid? Because there is no excuse for that. There, there is not a single excuse that I can think of that would make you somehow the victim or innocent in this situation. You're eating chemicals. You might as well just go to a nuclear power plant and start drinking the water there. Why did Japanese kids just made a challenge to go and swim in the Fukushima waters or in the sea there? Because they're not so stupid. All right? They're not. Why are you so stupid? Why are you that stupid? And yes, I am using the word stupid a lot, but come on. I could be using far worse words than that, you know? But that's what I wanted to discuss about the Tide Pods, because the topic is pretty spent. I'm just expressing my personal anger with what's happening in the world and how the IQ of the population is dropping like an avalanche. But with that, I want to move on to the second. The meme, that meme that refuses to die, that is everywhere and it is everywhere because of one game and that game is called the VR chat where everyone can be whatever they like and what do they choose to be mainly? A caricature of the Sonic character assimilated by wannabe Ugandans who like to spit, name their queens and give you fictional Ebola. Where do I begin? First of all, why? I, I mean, I know it's a meme. I know it doesn't have to make sense. But why? Why the spitting? Why the clicking noises? Why the tribe? Why the Ibole? And why do you know the way? I know it was funny. Yes, it really was funny at maybe week one. But now what the hell? Come on, die already, or merge with the others. 
what makes you so special? What makes it so special? I'm trying to figure it out and it's not funny anymore. Even the jokes haven't been spent up and yet it still kicks in. It's still kicking. They still do it every single day. I have friends who have learned to communicate entirely by clicking noises. I'm not even joking. The only question they know how to answer or to ask is, do you know the way? Yes, I do know the way and to proceed to make more clicking noises. It is annoying. Stop it, please. Do I have to make a new meme for you? Do I have to go draw tails with five tails and a hentai body and a dildo up her at his ass? No, don't make me do that, please. I, I, I don't want to do that. In any case, just what do you need to die? Do you need Tide Pods? I can give you Tide Pods. You, you can make a new meme, okay? There it is. There it is. The single greatest idea of 2018. A new meme, a merger of two things. Ugandan Knuckles eating Tide Pods and dying in very, very, very much pain. Please, do a nuclear assault on all the Uganda Knuckles and blast their tribe with Tide Pods who explode in their mouths and just end it already. End it. And let's move on to even more pointless memes and more pointless characters and more pointless thing to worry about while World War 3 is coming on our doorstep. Alright? That's what we need to do. That's what expected of us. Let's do it. Until then, cheers and we're we know the way.